How are you? Hi, Greg. I'm fine. How are you? Good, doing well. Good to see you. And, and I also have to say this. I mean, obviously, a whole interesting story. You're the director. You also wrote the screenplay. Talk a little bit about what about this story just made you want to get involved? Well, you know, I did a lot of scuba diving in my life when I was, especially when I was a little bit younger. And I just, I just love diving and I love the ocean. And when the production company approached me with that idea and the project to do this, I, uh, yeah, I thought, I mean, I have to do it. I can't say no to the opportunity to, like this. I mean, you, you know, I'm just, a, I'm just a German director who's not, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> this is not uh, this is a this is an opportunity that doesn't come every day so i had to do it yeah also with what you just said i've got good friends dear friends and who live in germany so i already told them hey it's going to be coming out in september so they're looking forward to seeing it there ah, great that's good uh, thanks for that you got it also it's something about this story where you know like if you watch say like a, a slasher movie or something like that where you're seeing the character you know who's like the bad person who you know just looks bad or whatever you get scared with that. This movie will scare you. I think it's because when you watch it, you see that this stuff could be real. This could actually happen to you. So you definitely are drawn into each of the characters and you're just going, wow. Yeah, absolutely. Well, that was the idea to make it as real as possible. And to actually everything that, that happens is it's, it's actually it's possible. All they do all with, with the beer, everything it's, it's like, it's like very, down to earth in a way and uh yeah it was a very very early decision no sharks no um <laughs> not, no aliens no whatever and it's just the two i mean it's a very very in a, in a way it's a very very simple story and a very simple concept which often i guess is a good thing yeah I, i'm really laughing because i was you know when checking you know what different people thought about the movie that was one of the biggest comments thankfully there were no sharks so <laughs> <laughs> it's always the poor sharks i mean yeah yep. sharks are like the, the the villains today but they are actually not so yeah right i mean they're just doing their thing they're they're in the water looking for something to eat and you know boom exactly exactly we join in then also uh for a director i mean basically you have a cast of two people so that had to be a very nice close and intimate uh time talk a little bit about that yeah, I mean, first we were looking for uh, actresses who can actually scuba dive, but that was a helpless offer because <laughs> yeah, it's just too few of it, and we skipped that. So, so we were looking for actresses who were crazy enough to do this and were willing to train uh, scuba diving. Mm -hmm. And then we found um, Sophie and Louisa in a long casting process. But then they had to, after the casting process, we had to, to start training them. And, uh, you know, with diving, it's, it's always a little bit, it's a tricky thing. I mean, you can, you can start doing it and you feel comfortable and you feel you're like good at it, but then you have one bad experience and it ends. And it's like a psychological like thing and you and it switches and then you don't, you think, no, I'm not doing it anymore. And I was like in this whole process, like the weeks and the months before the shoot, I was really nervous and anxious that I got the call. I'm sorry, but they, <laughs> they skip. They they don't want to do it anymore. Uh, but luckily enough, you know, we we really made sure that the training in the, in the beginning was really just to 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 make sure that they have fun with diving mm -hmm. because diving is awesome. Diving is amazing, and you know, and I really wanted them to love it. And then it's because and, and because then. If they hated it, it would be such a terrible work they had to do. Right. And, you know, you know what they had to do. You know, if you if you if you act fear and terror and panic underwater, it's very close to the real emotion, right? And when you, right. they really panic underwater, it's really dangerous. Yeah. So, so they had to be really good, and we made sure that they're really, 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 yeah, trained professionals. Then that right. Way. <laughs> and you are absolutely right. There's nothing more frightening than a person who is afraid of the water trying to get them on the water. I mean, that's yeah, an impossible that's task. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, absolutely. It, and then something else that also draws us in that I'll probably finish up with this is the fact of knowing that there was a timeline, you know, that you've got X amount of minutes or whatever to get everything taken care of, because if not, boom. So, I mean, that's something else that kind of brings us all in too. We all begin to you know, rush along with it, like, okay, 
okay, maybe I, I'd swim that way or whatever. But I mean, that's something else that really brings the audience into the film. Yeah, that's uh, the ticking clock. It's, it always works. <laughs> But then you know, I thought you know all those all this 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 elements of the ticking clock and the and the the pure edge of the sea thriller elements, they were like I knew that they would work in a in a way, and I could rely on them story wise. So I had like I could allow myself to be a little bit more um, um, psychedelic right. in the stream of consciousness of May, and like not to being too precise about all oh, what's going on and the family trauma and the you know the backgrounds mm -hmm. and yeah and I tried to make this part of the film like a little bit more yeah associative is that the right word associative Asso yeah yeah. So, yeah and a little bit more subtle and right. loose was it? Yeah. well fantastic Maximilian thank you so much for your time uh, like I said, I'll tell all my other friends about it, you know, not only here in Detroit, but again, all around the world to uh, check it out. And like I tell you, it's a thriller. Thanks so much. Thank you very much, Greg. All right. Take, same here. Take care.